Okay. There we go. There we go. Oh, okay. okay. All right. All right. Um, great. Okay. How, tell me okay. how you guys felt after Tuesday. How did you feel after Tuesday? Actually, I felt pretty good. I, I felt better afterwards than before. <laughs> That's all here. <laughs> me, me too. It was a good, it was, I felt good too right after. That was a very good class. It really was. Wow. I'm so glad I taught that on, um, let's see, Friday morning. I taught it on Friday morning too, and everyone seemed to really like it too. It was, it was challenging. <laughs> Long intervals are always challenging. Yeah, for sure. For sure. Mentally, you guys did a great job. Mentally as well as physically. Right. Oh, my gosh. Yeah. Yeah, for sure. For sure. Andy, how much longer do you have on vacation? A week. Oh, good. You still got another week. Good. Yeah, it's great. Good. Did you miss uh, snow? Did it come your way up uh, in Canada then? Oh, yeah. Yeah. We did get some up there. <laughs> okay. Do you have any kind of uh, camera set up in your place that you can see what's going on? No, but I got something better. I have my neighbor. He keeps me plowed out. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's even better, isn't he's it? Very, he's very kind. A oh, great neighbor. that's wonderful. We all love having neighbors like that. But I know you would do you would do it for him in a heartbeat. Oh, yeah. We uh, we take care of each other. Good. I'm so glad. I'm so glad. Well, good. Good, good, good. Well, I don't know how many people are joining us. I think there's several of us, um, several people that can't make it today. So, but you know what? That's okay. That's okay. That's why we have those recorded classes. Anybody can do those yeah. classes. So, and I, and I see according to what I, you know, I look on them occasionally when I post another class and it's amazing how many views they've had. So um, I don't know if it's just you guys doing them or if it's lots of other people doing them. So it doesn't make any difference as long as they're getting used. So oh, you can't tell that that you can't tell who is the view. I don't think so. I um, maybe if you've got a if you know how to do that, let me know. I really I probably haven't even. I don't know if you've, I've even looked, to be honest with you. I don't think, I don't know whether you can or not. I've never done it. Yeah, kind of privacy thing. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. So that's okay, though. That's okay. Um, yeah, if they're getting used, boy, I'm telling you, it, uh, I think that'd be wonderful. Thank you know, you. just some aside, mm -hmm. Adrian went to PT yesterday at HealthFit. Yeah. She noticed there was a Parkinson's class going on, not a yeah. class, class. All men. Oh. Uh, that's people. interesting. She thinks there was about 10 people and there was not a woman in the class. What a shame. Well, huh. what, do you, what do you think about that? Just the women don't want to do it or you think the were... I I was surprised. I still don't know. Maybe you're right. Mm -hmm. Maybe you're right. Yeah, 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 yeah. I, I'd, I'd like to pop in and see what they're doing. Anonymously. They a rock study, a uh, rock uh, steady boxing class there. They hired. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I don't, I don't have time to do anything else, but um, I'd like to, you know, I would like to make sure everyone's doing it correctly, all of it. Yeah. You know? but, yes. You know what? We need to let go of that. All we can do is all we can do, right? We just need to take care of us. <laughs> and whoever wants to join us, I can't control the world. <laughs> you got to do the best you can. That's exactly right. Exactly. And you, right. Do. And you so, do. Thanks. Andy, you're warming up, right? I am. Okay, good. Thank you. Yeah, you're welcome. You're welcome. Steve, how are you doing? I'm good. Good, I'm glad. I'm glad. Nice to see you today. Good to be here. Good, 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 good. Maybe it's just the four of us. We'll see. We'll see. For Saturday, sometimes Saturdays are tough, you know? So uh, that's okay. That's okay. Yeah, so if you guys want to start warming up, please go ahead. We've just got about three more minutes, and then we'll get started. Um, okay. Yeah, and, and Phil's going to take it easy today. He's traveling this afternoon, so. 
We'll, we'll, ahead, it, we'll scale it back a little bit. We're flying to New Orleans to see Margaret. Oh, oh yeah, Margaret. Great. Uh, that would be fun. It should be. And here's Carol. Good to see you, Carol. Thank you. I cut a hole in my shoe because the blister is not peeled. So I'm writing in my in my shoes that have the hole cut in it. Oh my gosh. Your blister. Remind me where it is. It's on my bunion. Oh, that's right, your bunion. Yeah. And I sent you that. I sent you that. Yeah, my my yeah. cycling shoes are too tight on the bunion. So oh. I just cut a hole in my tennis shoes. Uh huh. I try to ride with that. Oh, Carol, that's terrible. How now? Oh, yeah. You said you were walking in shoes that were rubbing. Mm -hmm. yeah. Um. Yes. Yes. Uh huh. That's how you got it, right? Yeah. Yeah. And you did get my. You did get that information on that shoe that I talked about, right? I sent that to you. Yes. Okay. Great. Great. I just bought a pair of that brand trail. They're called trail runners for my, uh, for, um, you know, a long hike that I'm going to do in Spain. And, uh, I'm getting, I'm, I've got those on right now and I'm going to, I'm going to hike in them today, just on a flat road. So I'm going to see how it works. So hopefully they're going to have a wide enough toe box that I don't get a blister. So yeah. I wonder if there's a cycling shoe with a wider toe box, Carol. I, I couldn't don't... find one when I looked, but this is a couple oh. of years ago. She'd have I... to get a cleat too, yeah. Yeah, they so have, what to have I cleats. Do is get an extra length to get a little more width. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and that's not good on a cycling shoe. I know. And I thought the Peloton was the Peloton shoe was a little wider toe box than like my other you know brand that I use for uh, my SPDs. It but, is? Um, yeah, Good. I thought I thought it was a little wider, but yeah, they're pretty narrow. They're pretty narrow. You're right, no matter what. They are, yeah. Yeah. Well, let's get started, guys. We got nine o'clock. We got nine bells. So let's get going. Okay. Get going. Good morning. Good morning, Susan. Great to see you today. Thank you. Nice to see you. Good. We got a seven minute warm up, so we're gonna give that a go right now. So let's start seventy. Right around 70 RPMs. Let's start right there with Bates gear on. Every minute we'll change it. We'll go 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, and then we'll back it down. We've done that uh, several times. So um, we're gonna repeat it today. So it's Saturday, so it depends on how you're feeling today, what you wanna do as far as intensity goes. So please feel free to amend the intensity according to how you're feeling today and what you're doing the rest of the day. So make sure that you're listening to your bodies. So Susan has done something interesting today. Do you want to share what you've done as far as uh, preparing for class today? Well, I think it may be a little silly, but I have to leave at 930. I apologize. So I did a really great recorded class the first half hour. And now I've signed on with you guys. So I've already been through a warm up. Wow. <laughs> and a well, couple of can, stages. Yeah. It's, I think it's I think it's so creative. I really do. I think and it just shows your <laughs> persistence and your dedication to your workout, which I think is fabulous. So that's what I'm you know, I think that's great. Let's bump this up to 75. So what you can do, Susan, if you want to continue this, you can you can you can treat this as a stage workout. So if you want to just stay at 80 to 90 and kind of come with us that way, and it looks like you have gotten a nice workout. So good for you. Good for Thank you. Thank you. How was your heart rate during that workout? I didn't get super high. Um, I think about 110, 111. And you know what? Riding by yourself without, without me there, I think that's a great idea. I think that's a great idea. So good for you. Good for you. Thank you. All the way around. Okay, so warming up, 80 RPMs. Let's go now for a minute. Andy, how are you handling this warm up? 112. Okay, good. I think I'm doing, and, doing better. Yeah. Okay, good. Uh, are you at 14? 16, actually. I bumped it up today. Oh wow! Feeling strong. That's crazy. Are you being crazy today? Okay, okay. 
<laughs> okay. Let's see where it goes, okay? Let's see where it goes. Okay. Be careful now. Okay, and here comes Marge, and I think it's Polina. I thought Polina was on vacation. Vacation, but maybe not, maybe not. All right, 20 more seconds to go, guys. Um, at 80 RPMs and Susan stay right there even if you want to and you can accelerate if you want with us it's totally up to you how you're feeling 10 seconds to go all right so we're at um, five four three accelerate now 85 with base gear the gear that you started with let's go to that Carol you having trouble with that pedal stroke um, it's getting better. Okay. Okay. It looks like you are it, and uh, the shoe is probably part of it, right? Yeah. Yeah. And you don't have a cage. You're on top of the pedals, right? Right. Right. Yeah. Oh boy. <laughs> Be tough. safe, my friend. Be safe. All right. 30 seconds to go. I think someone else rode on top of the pedals one time. Who was it? I think it? Carolina did. Was it plain? Okay. Okay. I'm on. Right. I'm on top. Are, Are you, you on top of the? Wait a minute, Andy. What? Oh yeah, yeah. I'm on top of the pedals. Oh. I have my cleats. Oh well, yeah, your cleats. Right, 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 right. But she doesn't. No, but she's, okay. she's not cleated in. She's not cleated in. So she's got tennis oh, okay. shoes on. Yeah, she's got a blister. You're right. Oh yeah, right. Okay, guys. All right, let's bump this up now. Five more RPMs. Giddy up. Right. Okay, great. Good. Where are we at now? You froze up. <laughs> I totally threw you up. I think we're bumped up to 90 already, aren't we? Oh, okay, that's what I thought. Yeah, yeah, we're all, all bumped up to 90 already. Wow, that went fast, didn't it, Andy? It did. <laughs> <laughs> we start chatting. I was, can you walk and chew gum at the same time? <laughs> Sometimes. Oh, wait a minute. If you're a man, you can't. Yeah, that's right. Only women <laughs> can multitask. All right, 20 seconds to go. I was talking to a gentleman and the I other do day, ask for and he was, he, we were talking about multitasking, and he can do it. Oh, my gosh, he's fabulous. He's fabulous. 10 seconds to go, better than me, even. Uh, and I'm the queen of multitask. All righty, four, three, two, one, back it off, 70 RPMs, just a little slow it down. You're, you're going down 20 RPMs, down 20 RPMs. It should feel delicious. <laughs> Enjoy this. Enjoy this. Okay, so warm-up's going to move right into stage one. No breaks. So if you haven't had any water, Susan's had a ton of water because she's already ridden a, a half a class. So 30 seconds to go at 70, we'll bump up to 75, we'll add a gear, we'll bump up to 80, and that's where we're gonna start the stage, our first stage. So we're gonna go warm up into first stage right here. 20 seconds to go at 70 RPMs. Good morning, Stacy. There's my Polina and Simon. Good Hello. to see you. Good. Good morning. Good, and Marge, we can't see you though, but are you there? I'll ask her to unmute. Okay, now it's 75 RPM, just base gear, base gear. Good, stay right there, good, good, good. Stay right there, guys. When we move to 80, which we will in 40 seconds, we're gonna be adding a resistance turn. For those of you who have been able to do the ladder up, and staying within that 70 to 80 RPM parameter, what we'll ask you to do is add one more turn of resistance. But Andy, it's going to depend on your heart rate. Okay. Okay. Okay, good. Hey, Marge, I got you. I got you, honey. Good job. Good job. <laughs> Excellent. Stacy, are you good? I'm, I'm okay. Just running a little late here. <laughs> That's okay. No problem. Okay, five seconds. Here we go. If you've been able to do that ladder, go ahead, turn one more turn. Andy, check your heart rate. 114. All right, All right good. That You're good. All right, let's do it. Let's go to 80 RPM. Stay right here. We've got base gear plus one on board. Good. Good. So our first stage, 
is going to be about six minutes. Well, no, let's make it five minutes long, five minutes long. So 80 RPMs, we've got base gear plus one, if that's something you could do, okay. So Susan, we've joined you now, we've joined you. We're at 80 RPMs, okay. Stacy, feel free to warm up. Feel free, Polina, feel free to warm up. Marge, feel free to warm up. All right, good job, good job, okay. 25 more seconds and we'll accelerate to 85. We held this 80 RPMs for one minute. Now what we'll do is we will shorten up that. We'll do 30 seconds at 85 and we'll do 15 seconds at 90. All right, let's take a deep breath, shoulders down, chest up, find your foundation for success. Go to 85 RPMs for 30 seconds. Great job. Great job, great job, great job. Excellent work. Recruiting more muscle fibers, heart rate. You're gonna feel like prestige exertions running ahead of your actual heart rate, I think. But Andy makes a liar out of me every single time, so I really can't, that's not a blanket statement. <laughs> Good at that. <laughs> All right, lift to 90 and hold for 15 seconds if available. Good. Great job. Great job. Great job. Great job. Great job. Five seconds to go. You're at 90. Please pull this back. 80. Pull it back. 80. Good job. One more time. One minute at 80. 30 seconds at 85. 15 seconds at 90. This is a five minute stage. Five minute stage, we'll recover after this. So it ends up being 12 minutes of actual warm up and first stage. So you should be really well oxygenated to begin that second stage. All right. Okay, so now holding here, holding here. Great work, great work. Now, as, we, as we're getting ready to accelerate, focus on your form and make sure as you accelerate, everything, everything stays quiet in the upper body, lower body does the job. Good, 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 get ready. You ready to go? Let's go. Now, good, 30 seconds, 85 RPMs, great job, great job. Wonderful job, wonderful job, wonderful job. Keep it right here, please. Good, 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 good. Excellent. Let's do it for 12 more seconds. Great job, great job. If 85 is all you can achieve, that's absolutely great. But if you would like to give it a little boost, go ahead, add your acceleration to 90, 15 seconds. Good job, wonderful. Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. Hold it for five, four, three, two. Pull it back 80 RPMs. Good job. Really great job. So 90 more seconds, 90 more seconds, and that will take us to recovery. How's everyone feeling so far? Good? Yes. Good. Yeah. Good. All right. One minute at 80. Right here, one minute at 80 RPMs right here. Great job. All righty, cool. Hold it here, please. Hold it here. 30 seconds, 30 seconds to go. All righty, elbows are soft. Try not to lean too hard or too much weight onto those handlebars. We wanna keep our weight back. We wanna be able to allow those hip flexors to move freely as freely as possible. 15 seconds to go. Fast pedaling is challenging. Forced cycling is challenging. You got both of those things on board right now. All right, 85 RPMs, kick it up. 30 seconds, good job, good job. So today we're doing that stage two training, low end stage three, that's where we've been hanging. We've been hanging the last several times we've met. That's what we wanna do. So I'm recording this class today for, for those of you who want to revisit this type of class again. Good, eight seconds to go, great job. Five seconds to go, wonderful job. Three, two, you're done. Pull it back, 70 RPMs, take your resistance off. You've got two minutes to recover. Let's get some heart rates. Good, Andy, let's start with you, my love. 
125. Couldn't be better, Andy. That's great. That's really great. Thanks. Good job. Yeah. Bill, how about you? Uh, 115. 115. Where's your resistance? 31. Okay, good. That was really good. Steve, how about you? Uh, 122 and 32. Wow, good. Carol? 125 and 24. Great job, Carol. Susan, where were you? 119 at uh, 34. Wonderful job. Thank you. That's great. Paulina, how did you do? Good job, Paulina. Great job. Marge, how are you feeling? Okay, but my monitor is not working. It's okay. It's okay, love. I'm glad you're here. Stacy. 119 at 31. Good job, Stacy. Great job. Everyone did great. We've got a little less than a minute to recover. So continue that recovery. 70 RPMs. Great work. Great. So our next stage, stage two, will be slightly more challenging. So Andy, we're going to lift this heart rate up just a little bit more, but not a whole lot. Steve, Good. I don't know what it is about your heart rate training the last few classes. It's been spectacular. Yeah. Yeah. Any any idea why? No, my blood pressure and my pulse rate during the day has been right on too. Wow, good. Yeah, so it's, it's good. It's good. I'm really glad to hear that. I'm really glad to hear that. Great. All right, here we go, guys. We're going back to that 80 RPMs, 80 RPMs. So what I want you to do is I want you to load the resistance you've had on the last effort. And as we accelerate again, we'll kind of get that mind to body connection. But then when we come back to 80, we're going to start loading gear. All right, so stay right here. Let's stay here for 30 seconds. We're just gonna change it up just a little bit. We'll stay here for 30. We'll stay at 85 for one minute, and then we'll stay at 90 for 15 seconds. Some days we stay at 90, a lot more. Today, not so much. Great. All righty, I know you're sad about that. <laughs> Let's go to 85 RPMs, 85 RPMs, pick it up. We've got a minute. Great job, guys. Excellent job. You're looking good. Marge, how you feeling? I'm okay, thank you. You're welcome, darling. Good. Good job, guys. Good job. Keep it right here. Keep it right here. Good. Good work, good work, good work. Good work. Hold it, please. Hold it, hold it, hold it. You're almost there now. 85 RPMs. Okay, now when we accelerate, when we accelerate to 90, it's going to be just a short little acceleration. But remember, you got to have good form. You want to control the acceleration. Sometimes when we're not there a lot, sometimes that mind to body connection, you know, it's not quite there. So make sure that pedal stroke is smooth, no hesitation, connect all the dots. Three, two, 90 RPMs, good, good, 15 seconds at 90, that's it. All right, so what I'm gonna have you do now, in five seconds, I'm gonna have you check in with your heart rate, pull it back 80, check in with your heart rate, all right. Anyone have a higher heart rate than what you quoted me on the last effort? No. Out of gear then. Out of gear. 117. That's good. That's, oh yeah, it is slightly higher, isn't it? Yeah. But that's okay. But Phil, you do what you want to do because I know you're traveling today. Okay. Okay. So if you've added a gear, great. If you haven't added a gear, it's okay. It's okay. Okay, stay right here, please. 80 RPM is our time to gather ourselves, focus on form, get ready to accelerate. Now, 85 RPMs, we've got one minute. I forgot to tell you that this is the six minute stage. So seven minutes to warm up, five minutes for stage one, two minutes to recover, six minute second stage. So that's how it unfolds. Okay, good. good. 
Good. Excellent. 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 Keep it right here. You're almost there. You're almost there. 85. Good. 85. Hold. Good. Hold. Good. Get ready. Here we go. Shoulders down. Chest up. Light hand grip. We're going 90 RPMs, 15 seconds. Let's go now. Good. Good. Really good, guys. You look great. You look great. You look great. You look great. Five seconds to go. Get ready to check in with the heart rate as you bring it back to 80. Bring it back to 80. Check in with the heart rate. All right, good. So let's stay here. Check in, Andy. 127. That's good. Carol? 130. Oh, boy, kiddo. Be careful. Yeah. Susan? 122. Good, good. Polina? Okay, Stacy? 122. Okay, great. Everyone looks good. If you can, 85 RPM. Steve, what was your heart rate? 120. That's good. Phil? 115. 115. Okay, okay, great. Everyone looks good. Susan, so it's 919 right now. So in four, four or five minutes, you need to recover. Okay. All right. Thank you. You're welcome. You're welcome. You're welcome. All righty, guys. 85 RPMs. Am I right? Yep. Yes. I love being right. 30 seconds to go. <laughs> 30 seconds to go. Good job. Good. Stacy, I saw you look. Is your heart rate coming up? No, it's about the same. Okay. 15 seconds to go. Get ready. We're going to take our acceleration to 90, and we're just going to hold for 15 seconds. Give it a goose in three, two, one. Let's go now. Good. 90 RPMs, 90 RPMs. Good job, good job, good job. Good. All righty. Good job, good job. 10 seconds in, five, four, three, two, pull it back, 80 RPMs, hold here. Good, check in with your heart rate again. Good work, Stacy. 124 now. Thank you, Andy. 129. Perfect, Phil. 121. 121, great. Car Carol? 131. Oh, okay. Polina? Okay, great. Susan? 122. Good. Steve? 116. All right, let's go to 90 RPMs. 80 to 90. We're skipping 85. We're finishing up the stage. Finish up the stage. Finish up the stage. All right, we've got six. Yep. Three. Yep. Two. Yep. One. Good job, good job, good job. Please pull it back. Please pull it back to 70 RPMs. Take your resistance off. Fantastic job. Fantastic job. Recover. Recover, recover, recover. Good work. Shut that. Good. That's better. All righty, guys. Excellent work. I, got, I have the heart rates you just quoted me. There's probably no changes, right? Okay. Mm -hmm. Wonderful job, guys. Wow, what a great job. I love this class, don't you? I love it. I love it. <laughs> good work, good work. And we're getting two minutes to recover here, two minutes to recover. I'm so proud of you guys, so proud of you. Good work. All righty. Hydrate, hydrate, hydrate. How's everybody feeling, okay? Yep. Yeah. Good. Good, good. Saturday morning. Saturday morning. You guys are all doing fabulous. Good. All righty. So stage three, we're going to just change it up again. We're going to change it up again. We're going to use a little bit more time at the top with 90, but not much. Nothing more than 30 seconds. So that's going to be okay. What do you prefer? Want to get it out of the way first? Yeah? Sure. No, we're not doing it. <laughs> I just wondered what you'd prefer. <laughs> no, we're going to we have a choice. That ladder. <laughs> 80, 85, 90. 
So, but the 90, we're gonna hold for 30 seconds. Great. We will be at 85 for 45 and 80 for 45 as well. So that takes us right into two minute block of work, right? What we're gonna do is we're gonna do this with the same resistance we had on the last effort. Let's go now. 80 RPMs load the same resistance you had on your last effort. We've got 45 seconds at 80. Good job. Good, good. So as you start this ladder, as you start this interval, this doesn't feel too bad. This feels like, yeah, this, I can do this, no problem. You've got mind-to-body connection, smooth rotation, everything is great. Everything is great. You're 30 seconds in, you have 15 more seconds to complete this 80 RPM opportunity. Great. So this is two minutes long. That's exactly what we're looking for. Let's go to 85. We are now there for 45 seconds. Great job. Great job. Great job, great job, great job. All right, good job. You've got 30 more seconds at 85. You're one minute into, we're almost a minute in. Good work. You are one minute in. Good. Good. Okay, so now the heart rate starts to respond. Good. Yeah. Oxygen, demand, perceived exertion should be even, even, evening out with the heart rate. Kind of one-on-one -on -one there. Good. Take a deep breath. We're going 90 RPMs. Now, 30 seconds at 90. Good. Great job, guys. Great job. 20 seconds at 90. I'm going to have you check in with your heart rate shortly in 15 seconds. Good work. Great job. Great job. Great job. We're going to get a recovery after this. Recovery after this. Five, four, three, two, Recover, grab your heart rate, good. All right, continue to come back to 70, take your resistance off. Susan, recover, okay? What's your heart rate, love? Oh, it's, it's, not, it's, it's not so high, it's about 110. That's okay, that's, that's great, that's absolutely great. I'm so glad you joined us today, great to see you today, great. Thank you, thank You're you. You're welcome, love, have a good weekend. Thank you. Um, don't you don't have to log off yet i'm not trying to get rid of you <laughs> just whenever you know whenever you have to go i understand daisy what was your heart rate 122 that's good 31 or 32 32 thank you marge how you feeling i'm okay good helena what's your heart rate good how was your acceleration was it pretty good it's Perfect. That's great. Good job. Good job. Yes, Carol. Oh, you're welcome, Carol. One thirty, and I stopped at eighty-eight rather than ninety. That's okay. That's okay. Steve, how about you? One twenty-two at thirty-three. Boy, that's perfect for today. Good work, Andy. One twenty-eight at eighteen. Perf 18. Wow. Strong today, aren't you? Phil? Yeah, good today. 120 at 31. Good. Excellent. I love it. I love it. All right. Oh, 20, 20 more seconds. We're going to do another two minute interval. We're going to start at 90 for 30 seconds. We're going to back down to 85 for 45. Oh, wow. Out of gear, find 80 for 45. So we're gonna do a descending interval, okay? Are you ready to go? 90 RPMs, load the resistance you had on the last effort, you have 30 seconds. It's only two minutes to work here. Yeah. Anybody can work for two minutes, especially you guys. Good job, excellent. Good job. 13 seconds to go at 90. Good job. Helena, good job, Helena, good job. Good. Thank you, thank you, 
You're welcome. 85 RPMs. Please pull it back. You've got 45 seconds. Great job, you guys. Great job. 45 seconds at 85. So we went out fast. We recruited the muscle fibers. Oxygen is there. Oxygen is available. Dropped it down 85. So in 20 seconds, I'm going to ask you to check in with your heart rate. In 15 seconds, I'm going to have you check in with your heart rate. Good. In 10 seconds, I want you to check in with your heart rate. Good. Five seconds. Please check in with your heart rate. Go to 80 RPMs to finish the stage. Stage Add a gear if you want. Good. Excellent. Excellent job. Excellent job, 30 seconds to go at 80. And when we do a heart rate check on this next check, I want to know if you added a gear. 20 seconds to go at 80. Wow, great job, you guys. Steve, you okay? Yeah. Okay, my, 10 uh, seconds to go, that's okay. That's I'm okay. I'm slipping a little bit off my cleat. Uh-oh, uh-oh, four, Three, two, grab your heart rate, recover again. Good work, you guys, good work. Woo, good job, Phil. How'd you do there? Oh, 124.33. Oh, you bumped it up, yeah. Two, okay, great. Steve, how'd you do before you came out of your place? <laughs> uh, 118 to 34. That's really good, Steve, good job. I'll tell you what, whenever my cleat slips, I think my heart rate goes up 10 beats. <laughs> it's shocking. It is. It is. Yeah. It's scary. You don't know what's going to go, how it's going to go. You're just reaching for that break really fast, right? Well, it causes you to center of gravity to. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah, you're right about that. You're right about that. Stacy, how'd you do? 120 at 32. Wow, okay. Okay, great. How about you, Marge? Did you do pretty good? I can't tell. It doesn't work. Sorry. No, 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 honey. I just want to make sure you're okay. I know you don't have a heart rate. Okay. I'm okay. 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 Polina, how'd you do on that? Okay. Okay, great. Great, Carol. How about you? 127 at 24. Wow, you guys are all doing great. Andy. 127 at 19, and then the second one was 132. Brilliant job, kiddo. Great job. Great job, great job, great job. 30 more seconds to go. All righty, so let's do that one again. That was super successful, super successful. Real short interval, two minutes long, changing up the RPM. Now, Andy, how do you want to play this? Do you want to go to the highest resistance? Sure. Okay. <laughs> but remember, we're starting at 90. All right. Okay. Let's go now. 90 RPMs. <laughs> Choose your resistance wisely. Good. You can always drop gear. You can always drop gear. Okay. 30 seconds at 90, 45 at 85, 45 at 80. Okay. Come on. It's almost like a little bit of a game, isn't it? It's like a little bit of a game. You just mess around with it, mess around with it until you find the key to success. Yes, that's right. All righty, 85 RPMs, 45 seconds. Good job, good job, good job, good job. Good, That go it goes fast. Two minutes goes fast. Wonderful, 30 seconds to go, 30 seconds to go. Wonderful job, wonderful job. I want to know where they're going for that St. Patty's Day party. I just saw them walk by. <laughs> yeah, I think, I think they're headed to the Zumba class next door. Oh, I love it. I love it. I love it. I love group exercise. 10 seconds to go. You're at 85. I'm going to have you check in with your heart rate. Go to 80 RPMs, last 45 seconds right here. Carol, what's your heart rate here? 129. Perfect, Stacy. 124. 
Excellent, Andy. 128. Ah, good, Phil. 121. Oh, good, Steve. 117. Wonderful job, Helena. Thanks, All righty, good job, guys. Good job, 20 seconds to go. Wonderful job, Andy, do you have 20 on there? 19. Now, okay, very good, 10 seconds to go. Nineteen. I love it. Nineteen is perfect. Good job. Four, three, two, and recover. Seventy RPMs. Pull it back. Good job. You've got recovery for two minutes. Great work. Seventy. Take your resistance off. All righty. So that was fun. Seven minute warm up. Six minute first stage. Five minute second second stage. The stage three and four were only two minutes long. Great. So let's start building up the time under tension. We've got everything, we've got all that oxygen on board. All that oxygen on board. Good. So you've got 90 more seconds to recover. So take advantage of this. Take advantage of this. Make sure that you are hydrating, your posture breaking it back, doing whatever you need to do to be successful. Okay, great, great. So the way we'll play the next stage is we'll use that oxygen available. We'll try to plateau those heart rates, plateau those heart rates. So as you start to find the heart rates that you just gave me, we want to find what we need to do to keep the heart rate plateaued. So that means we don't want to see any big jumps or big drops. I think that's the hardest part of heart rate training is maintaining a certain heart rate. Now, just like Andy had 127, you don't have to stay right at 127. You know, just slightly up, maybe slightly under, but if you averaged it out, it would be 127. That's kind of what we're looking for. Okay, so in 20 seconds, we're gonna go to the highest resistance we used on the last effort. We'll hit 90 or 80 RPMs one more time and we'll ladder it up. All righty, so here we go. Three, two, one. You're going to 90 RPMs, 90 RPMs. I'm sorry, 80 RPMs, sorry, sorry, 80 RPMs. Highest resistance you used on your last effort. Now, this is gonna get just slightly boring because we're gonna be here for a while. And you're going to be watching the heart rate develop. And that's kind of what I want you to do. I want you to see how, how strong you guys are. You are so strong. Good. 30 seconds to go. And as soon as you put that gear on, and as soon as you start to accelerate, the oxygen demand is there, right? So it just kind of that heart rate just starts to climb nice and slowly. All right. Every minute we're gonna check in with your heart rate. Don't touch your knob, Phil. <laughs> okay. Three, two, check in with your heart rate right now. All right, now, what do you need? Do you need more RPM right now to accelerate? Go up towards 85, don't lift above 85. You're trying, so Andy, you're trying to get to 127. Okay. Phil, you're trying to get into the mid 120s. Steve, oh gosh, let's get into the low 120s, right around 120, that's perfect. Carol, 127 is brilliant, wonderful. Um, Stacy, of course, let's start bringing this up into the low 120s. Carol, and I think Carol Polina, let's try to reach into the high 90s, okay? All right, good. All right, so you're at 85 RPMs or towards 85 RPMs. Has anyone reached their number that I just asked them to? Yes. yes. Yep. Stay yeah, there, yes. Phil. Just stay there. Good. Everyone stay there. Stacy, if you haven't reached it yet, start lifting your RPM just enough. Maybe yeah. one. Maybe two. Oh my gosh, this is not easy, is it? Now, try to focus on your breath. 
Inhaling through the nose, exhaling through the mouth. If you would like, that helps me. If I exhale through my mouth and I extend the exhale, I can see my heart rate start to kind of come down a little bit and then plateau. And then it starts coming slowly back up again. Great. All right, so you're two and a half minutes in. Two and a half minutes in. Carol, where's your heart rate? 130. Oh, kiddo, you sure you want to go back to 80? Okay. Okay. Stacy? Yeah, 122. That's perfect, honey. Andy? 130. A 130. Okay, sweetheart. Let's drop it back just a little bit closer to 80. Let's see what happens to that heart rate. Okay. How about you, Phil? Uh, 130 and 34. So what are you doing? Are you backing off to 80? Not yet. All right. Okay. Steve, how I'll about go, you? I'll go to 33. Thank you. 123. That's perfect. Thank you for that. Polina, where's your heart rate? Good. Stay there. Everyone, Marge, you hanging in? I'm hanging in. Yay. Yay, Marge. Okay. Keep it right here, guys. You've got 20 more seconds. All righty, so if your heart rate is right where you need it to be, Stacey, I want you to remember your power number right there. Andy, what do you got, wattage? Yeah. All right, what's your wattage, hon? Uh, 59. 59, great. Everyone remember their I'm output. 80, though. All right, that's good. And recover, 70 RPMs, take your resistance off. Great job. Great job, great job, great job. So finding the output with the RPM and the resistance, that's the key to success right there. Yeah, good job. So if you had output, so Polina, you had output there. You had output, you had a number that shows your output, how hard you were working, am I right? Maybe. Maybe. Does it say that on the screen? Does it show you a number that says output or power? Okay. All right. So that number is what you're going to work out on, on the last effort, the last effort. Okay. So we have, we still have uh, less than a minute to recover. 70 RPM. Stacy, what was your output there at the end? Like 73. That's good. And you know, you and I both know you can work much harder than that, but that's not what we're doing today, right? Okay. All right. Uh, Carol, what was yours? 33. Her, oh, that's all right. Honey, you're right without any cleats. <laughs> I don't even know how you're doing it. You're just you. <laughs> yeah, and the breath of the pedal stroke that's bringing your heart rate up. <laughs> Oh man, you're amazing. Phil, what was your output? 77. All right, good. And Steve? 80. 80. All right, here we go, guys. Last stage. All righty. Start around 83, 84 RPMs. Start around 83, 84 RPMs, okay? Now, add your resistance in until you find your output, your power that you were successful with that we just discussed. Great. All righty. We're going to stay right there. We're going to stay right there. Now, it takes a while for the heart rate to catch up, right? That's why we have this, these numbers that we're working with right now, the power, the output, the wattage. Andy, does that make sense? Yep. Yeah. Okay, so we've, we've, we've worked all class to find that. We've worked all class to find that because every day it kind of changes. It stays kind of within that range, but every day it changes because we're different on every day. All righty, so stay right here. Good. You're going to be done in two minutes. You're going to be done in two minutes. So make this effort a good one. Make it a good one. All righty. Now, check in with your heart rate. See where it's ha what's happening. 
Yeah. Anyone higher than what you quoted me on the last effort? All right, good. Keep it here. Keep it here. Nope. What, Andy? 129. Okay, good. Good. No higher, Andy. No higher. Not today. Not today. Okay. All right, good. Now, come on, you guys. This is good, isn't it? This is good. Yep. Life is good right here. This is where it all comes together. All these, all these months, years of heart rate training come together here. You have to be so proud of yourself. So proud of yourself. You got one minute to ride. Can you maintain that heart rate? If the heart rate is not high enough with this power or output that you, you want it, you can keep your RPM just a little bit higher, maybe closer to 85. Once we go over 85, get closer to 90, boom, that heart rate happens. We don't want that. We want to keep a cap on it today. Wow, this is better than I thought it was going to be today. I'm so proud of you guys. Stay with this for 30 more seconds. 30 more seconds. Can you do it? Yes, of course you can. Steve gave me a big thumbs up. 15 more seconds. You're almost there. Your third day of this week of cycling is almost over. Eight seconds. Good. Five seconds. Get ready to check a heart rate and recover. Good job. You're done. Woo -hoo 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 -hoo. No. I had no intention of doing that at the end. I had no intention. That wasn't where I was going today, but the way this class was unfolding, you guys were so ready for that. So ready for that. I'm so proud of you. Carol, how did your heart rate handle that? Just fine. It stayed below 128. So happy for you. And that she gets a gold star because she doesn't even have cleats on. <laughs> you get a gold star plus sparkles. Yeah. All right. We do. <laughs> Stacy, how about you? I got to 126. I, I um, added one resistance. So I was at 33. That's great. That's really great. Good job, Steve. Um, <clears throat> 127. Mm -hmm. My cadence was 85. Mm -hmm. um, output was 85. Man, good. And uh, resistance was 34. Wow, that was great. That was great. How about you, Phil? How about you? Uh, let's see, heart rate 128. The resistance was 34, and the output was 80. 80. Wow, that seems to be a good number for you all the way around. Yeah, for sure. Andy, uh, tell me about you. Okay, 135 at 18, and uh, it was uh, 59 and 60. Wow, on the good. Water. That was good. That was out great. Wonderful. Polina, how about you, honey? Let's see. It's about 80. Yeah. So you feel great, don't you? Good. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe glad it's over, right? <laughs> and Marge, way to hold up, Missy. Way to hold up. Good job. Excellent. Excellent. All righty, kiddos. Great job. Great third day of cycling. Great job this week. I hope you guys will, will stretch upper body and lower body, and then you'll be free to go. I think you guys are amazing. Amazing. Have a great weekend. Shake out our wrists. Drop our hands down to our side. Roll our shoulders up, back, and down. Let's take a huge inhale, bringing all the way up, inhaling, <coughs> exhaling all the way down. Place our fingers behind us, walk our shoulders back. Good job. Lift our chest up, drop our shoulders, really take a deep breath here. You guys deserve it. And slowly release it. Bring the arms around, lace the fingers together. Hands press away, palms facing forward, chin lowers to chest. Good job. 
Let's look forward, reach up all the way. We're gonna take our right arm down, hold on to the bottom of our saddle. Lift our left arm up and lean towards the right, stretching out through that oblique. We haven't okay. done that in a while. What's that? We haven't done this one in a while. I love this. This is my favorite. Yeah. Jump over. I know it. Hold well, that's on. Good. I think my our obliques deserve a stretch today, don't you, Steve? And reach up and down. Good. All righty. Let's bring our arm across our chest. Either arm. Good. Reach out, bend the elbow, guide the elbow up high. Good job, excellent work. And release it down, shoulder roll up, back and down. Good. Opposite arm comes across. Good, keep those shoulders down, stretch, stretch. Reach out, bend the elbow. Guide that elbow up high. Wonderful work, guys. Everyone looks great. Release it out. Lower it down. Shoulder roll. Good job. Eagle arms for Andy. Open. And club. Close. Hug your tree. Right elbow into the crook of the left or left elbow into the crook of the right. Squeeze. And lift those elbows up right in front of the chin or the mouth. Good work, take flight, lower down, release it out. Same thing, open, hug, opposite elbow. You'll know, your body will say, whoa, 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 I've already done it. Squeeze and lift, good. So you know why the eagle arms are, are mine? What's because that? I, What's eagle, that? It's be, the, eagle are, the eagle pose is mine because the eagle is the Post office is simple, oh, that's and funny. I was the post. I was the postmaster. <laughs> Perfect, Andy. <laughs> Absolutely. Absolutely. Check in. Make sure those heart rates are down. If you are, you're okay. Reach all the way out to end handlebar. Rise up off the saddle. Good. Feet are parallel to the floor. Great job. Continue to stretch by softening the front knee, dropping the heels down. Wow, stretch out through the Achilles tendon or calf. Good work, when you're ready, when you're ready, go ahead, rotate those pedals after you lift your chest. Good work. Great, do the same thing on the other side. That's really great, you guys, good job. Great, and when you're ready, just go ahead, come up, and just slowly come off the bike. Now, when you come off the bike, you wanna make sure that you have your balance, okay? Especially after a class like that. Good job, great. All righty, guys. I don't think you need to see my train table back there. <laughs> All right, so hold on to your frame. Good, we're gonna stretch out first with a hamstring stretch. We're gonna step forward with the right foot, step back with the left, shift your weight to the left heel, flex your right foot, and hinge forward. Good job, drive that right heel into the floor. Really stretch out through the hamstring. Good work. We're gonna exchange feet today. So come up, step in, same thing on the other side. Left foot forward, step back with the right, Flex your left foot, set back supporting right heel. Feel the stretch here on the left hamstring. It's that middle hamstring, good. So come all the way up, step together. I want you to kick out this now, good. So we'll step back with our right foot. We're gonna bring our right heel up, come into a lunge position and tuck underneath that hip. So we wanna stretch out through the right hip flexor. Good, if you would like to, lift your right arm up and come to the side towards the left. But make sure that you have your balance. You do not have to do that if you don't feel balanced. Okay, so come all the way up. Hand finds the handlebar or the side, untuck. Now, step together. 
Left foot goes back, left heel up, lunge, tuck underneath that hip, stretching the psoas, left arm comes up, and to the right. Good, good. Excellent work. Come up, float down, untuck the left hip, and step together. Good work. Shift the weight to the left foot. Let's bring up the right knee. Cross that right ankle over the top of the left thigh. Bend the left knee. Come down into a one-legged squat. We'll stay on this left foot as we rise. Lift up your right knee. Reach down for the right foot. Knee down, hip down. Lengthen out through the quadriceps. Good work. As we release the right foot, take it behind the left ankle. Squeeze the inner thighs towards each other. Right arm goes up. And we lean once again to the left. Good. Reach up and float down. Uncross these legs, kick out. Now, when you're ready, shift the weight to the right, lift up the left knee, left ankle crosses over, and sink down and back into that right heel. Outer hip, that was outer hip, slowly come up, lift up the left knee, reach down for the left foot, knee down, hip down, quadriceps stretch. Great work. As we release this foot, take the left foot behind the right, squeeze the inner thigh towards each other, lift up with the left arm, lean to the right, IT man stretch. Good job. Reach up and float down. And cross the legs, kick out. Feet separated, hip distance apart. Soften the knees, hinge from the hip, slide the hands down, cup your kneecaps with your palms, slide the shoulders down and back, chin tucks to chest, belly in, mid-back rises, tuck the tail, feel the delicious stretch through the mid and low back. Drag the fingers up the tops of the legs, Inhaling to reach up here. Exhaling all the way down. Great job, you guys. Fantastic work today. So Thank you. proud of you guys. You guys did such a great job today. Any questions, any concerns? Great work. Huh? Good. That was good. Very good. good. I'm so yeah, glad you guys enjoyed it. I so appreciate great. your coming. And I hope you guys have a great weekend.